So tell us about what the audience can expect. Well, Nine Circles is a play by Bill Kane, and it's a based on a real life event where an Iraqi soldier is uh, charged with a heinous crime that he committed while he was serving for our country. And the uh, play takes us through this journey of him arriving home, being charged with the crime, and meeting all these different uh, official uh, uh, people along the way um, as he tries to figure out what what to do with his life now that he's uh, back home. Okay, so the play has a pretty serious tone then. Yeah, it's a, it's a very intense play. It's a very smart play. Mm -hmm. It's often a funny play. Um, Bill Kane is a, uh, is a amazing playwright. So to work on a play like this is always a real uh, treat for actors and a director like myself. So I know the show was actually postponed last year due to the coronavirus pandemic. So tell me what exactly changed in returning to rehearsals a year later? Well, you know, we had to uh, involve the actors in a, in a very robust safety precaution process of wearing masks and being distant as much as possible until right before we started filming. But we were working for about a week and then the coronavirus hit. So we had about a week of rehearsal where we knew that this was going to be a great play. And that next act stuck with it a year later is just a, an amazing um, opportunity for us. And now that we get to bring it in this format, uh, you get really close to the action in a way that even in Next X intimate space, you wouldn't be able to. So it's a really unique experience. Wow. How challenging was that, you know, involving those changes? Um, you know, it, it took some getting used to. I mean, uh, imagine being a director, not being able to see half of someone's <laughs> face for four weeks. And then suddenly, right, as we're about to film, we're like, oh, okay, that's, okay, that's great. That, <laughs> that looks good. But that's, I mean, that's, Minor things like that. I mean, you wouldn't be able to tell through the production that we had to overcome those obstacles. I mean, these these actors are incredible in this performance. And what do you expect or hope audiences take away from this show? Well, you know, it was just announced last week, uh, President Biden talking about bringing U.S. troops out of Afghanistan, you know, 20 years into this war. I think the war has really faded in our public consciousness in a major way. I think this um, this play thrusts us back into the middle of that conflict and what we demand of the troops we spend o uh, send over there. And that there are troops that m maybe have served that shouldn't have been there in the first place because they're battling wars of their own. So I think the play asks us to confront what our responsibility is to the people we ask to serve uh, in these extreme circumstances. All right. Well, thank you again for joining us this morning.